formula for total area of a cone is area total equals pi r s plus r. The s plus r is in brackets and the r stands for the radius of the cone and the s stands for the slant height. Let's look at an example of finding the total area of a cone when we are given the slant height and the radius. My slant height is 3 centimeters, my radius is 2 centimeters. Total area equals pi, and we use 3.14 for these examples as our approximation for pi, times r, which is 2, times s plus r, which will be 3 plus 2. First thing I will do is simplify my bracket. 3 plus 2 is 5. Then I will multiply the 2 by the 5, which gives us 10. And then 10 times 3.14 will be 31.4. Because the distance is in the problem we're given in centimeters, the area's unit will be centimeters squared. Here's an example where we are given the total area and the radius, but we are asked for the slant height. Again, we are just plugging the values we have into the formula and simplifying. AT is replaced by 75.36. Pi is 3.14. Radius is 3. And slant height is our unknown, so we will just use s as a variable for it. And we have to put s plus the radius again, s plus 3. The first thing I'm going to do is multiply 3.14 by 3. Which gives me 9.42. Then I am going to multiply the 9.42 across the bracket. Which gives me 9.42s plus 28.26. Now I move the 28.26 to the other side of the equals. where it becomes negative. 75.36 minus 28.26 is going to be 47.1. And now, if I divide both sides by 9.42, these cancel. My S is isolated and is equal to 47.1 divided by 9.42, which is 5. Because the area was in meters squared and the radius in meters, slant height is a distance, it will be measured in meters. One way in which the question can have a tricky little extra step is if we are given the slant height and given the diameter instead of the radius, and asked for our total area. In order to find our radius so that we can use the total area of a cone formula, we just have to use the small diameter radius formula. Diameter is equal to 2 times radius. If the diameter is 8, then 8 equals 2r. Divide both sides by 2, cancel, cancel. r is equal to 8 divided by 2, which is 4. And now we can go ahead and plug into our formula. AT is our unknown, is equal to pi, which is 3.14, times R, which is 4, times S plus R, which will be 10 plus 4. Ten plus four is fourteen.
4 times 14 is 56. And pi times 56 is equal to 175.84. Because we were dealing with millimeters for our distances, the unit for area will be millimeters squared. The total area of this cone is 175.84 millimeters squared.